Did you know a spider bite can cause your flesh to rot? So while cleaning out a shed in Atlanta, Georgia, a 44-year-old woman named Jessica Rogue was attacked by a cluster of brown recluse spiders and had to be rushed to the hospital. Brown recluse spiders are commonly found in central and southern United States, and 90% of bites don't require medical treatment at all. The other 10% though, that's where things get a little serious. Their venomous bites can lead to flu-like symptoms, swelling, itching, and general soreness. But more severe symptoms can be a coma, kidney failure, blood in your urine, and necrosis, which is your skin rotting. Now, some people don't even know when they're bitten because they don't feel anything at all. Other people have reported they feel a bit of a sting. And in some cases, the bite really starts to hurt hours after. Going back to Jessica from Atlanta, less than 24 hours after she was bitten, her face and throat started to swell up. She was also covered in rashes and felt like her skin was on fire. Bad news is there's no anti-venom for brown recluse spider bites. The good news is there's ways to manage your symptoms, such as blood transfusions and other medical treatments. Now, brown recluse spiders have that name because they're generally pretty shy around humans. They tend to hide in attics or basements where there's not a lot of action happening and they're not likely to be bothered. That being said, maybe when you're doing spring cleaning, double check that there's no spiders around. Make sure to subscribe to How to Survive for more incredible survival stories and tips.